Hey, what's up? This is Joshua Casper, and welcome to another Ableton Live very quick tutorial. Uh, I want to show you about using VSTs just real quick. Um, so I've got Massive open here, which is, by the way, one of the dopest VSTs that I use anyway. Um, and I want to load a preset real fast just so we can, we can see what's going on. Now this isn't a tutorial about using Massive, but it's about using automation lines inside your set. And if you notice, if you come over here now, I've got Massive device on, and that's the only thing I can automate using my pen tool here. But if I click on past, notice that it changes to past here. So I've got device on in past now. And if I come over here to future, I've got device on in future. But um, Every time I open this, I don't want to, well, every time I want to automate something, like one of these eight knobs, I don't want to have to open up this bulky massive, and maybe I just want to draw in some automation lines. So the way to do that is come over here to your VST palette, hit this little arrow bar, and it comes over to this, and you just hit this configure button, and then come over and click whatever you want to use your automation lines for. So. I'm just clicking here. I'm just clicking on these knobs. And if you notice down here, what's happened is those knobs showed up here. And now if I deselect configure, I can come over here and now all my knobs that I clicked will show up here. And that can go for anything uh, inside any VST. And now instead of having to hit this and open this and play with it here, I can just um, you know, open it here and use it here and adjust these lines accordingly inside of the session view. Uh, I hope that helped. See you next time.